Right, just a quick reminder that we have our free sound effects still available. What you need to do to get them is go to bit.ly forward slash home sounds and it will bring you straight here where you can download them. So there's no catch at all, just I mean they're not the most exciting sound effects or anything really but you know use them how you like and if you do use them there will be a link in the description to them obviously um, and if you do use them please uh, let me know how you've used them I'd be interested to see how they've been used right um, I'm back in front of the green screen today and that is because I'm going to be showing you around basically how we make these videos how they're Test and what we have in this room so green screen is obvious um, you know currently voice is being recorded by a small microphone just here the only downfall with these is if you do this you get a, an awful noise um, And recorded by a small thing. This is great. It can. It's it's great for this, but um, I also connect this to a boom sometimes. And this is just the the audio recorder. And then, if we zoom out, remote control. Right, so now I've um, got the camera set up a bit differently. It's not on a tripod. It is sat on a stabiliser rig, which is perched on the edge of a bed, because this is my bedroom, as uh, you'll probably work out if I uh, flip it round like that. Um, so now I'm just going to... You see that we have the, the green screen set up ju just here. I'm not very used to doing this style of video. It's, it's a bit different for me. Um, let's just go go down here. This is the uh, the mandrel. Here we go the mandrel. Mm -hmm. I like the mandrel. The mandrel's very very recent addition um, to the stuff. So this this is the mandrel, and um, the mandrel's good because the mandrel charges my cameras for me. There's a power block in the back of the mandrel. It's just behind this this wooden thing. It's behind the mandrel altogether, really, and uh, it does um, charge the cameras. You can see my Coolpix here is plugged in, and that one should be plugged in, but it isn't at the moment. So I'm not going to plug that in now. Um, also in here I keep my microphone and my other microphones. Um, also I usually have my tripod but that's up there at the moment. Um, everything basically just lives in there. That's where we keep it uh, when we're not using it. Um, So over here again another another thing. This is my keyboard. I did um I did the show over there uh, the the other day, didn't I? 
because I couldn't be bothered to put that up. Um, that's basically that. This is going quicker than I thought it would actually. <laughs> then this this is the, the the desk of mess here. Yeah, here we are the the the, the desk, and I'll have a, a stereo for audio things and a laptop for uh, main moaning mainly. Yeah. I mean, it's not on, so you can't see the blue screen at the moment, but, you know, it, it works as a laptop-ish. <laughs> so then we've got the, the main computer. This is where I do my stuff. That's not actually the computer. I'm not going to fall into that trap. Um, But down there is the main one, it's i7, and I don't know anything else about it really. Um, so, that is, and I've not got any anything in the way of lighting really, apart from two angle poise lamps, which is not very professional, but uh, if I come over to this camera, the camera light here, very good because it's remote controlled and can change colour. That is, um, that's excellent. That is, um, so this is upstairs. This is my sort of office, and I have I have my chair there and my printer and. Another chair, which is my brother's, who is a total filth wizard. Yes, he lost the bolts, is what he says. Lost the bolts. Right, anyway. So, before we go through software and all of that stuff, um, I'm going to go downstairs, so I'll probably speed this up for a only set it's it's a TARDIS I built this um well sort of built it it's been painted and you need the key see that's well, a bit difficult and we can just open it up and go in so this is the TARDIS and it's very good for locking guns in because it's got a door with a lock. Um, so, there's a number of keyboards and various other controls in here. Um, one down there, falling over. I've not been in there very much because it's been the wind. Yeah, so this used to be a play shed. Well, it still is a play shed really. So you can see I've kept the uh, some of the old um, summer house type toy stuff, and uh, there's even the occasional sonic screwdriver in here, <laughs> and a Raspberry Pi up there, and that's from a guinea pig hutch. So I really really like it down here. This is my old my old Mac, um, which doesn't work anymore. Um, common problem with these old Macs, they just don't work after a while, they're just a bit like that. Leave through the door and I'll show you, show you the front again. So that's the front. Okay, um, we're at the computer now, so I'm going to sort of show you the computer. It does this when in standby mode. If you don't know, that is the um, TARDIS monitor screen. And it just wakes up, and um, we can start going into the software. So I'm just going to quickly um, go over to the um, screen recorder. <laughs>
Thank you.